Well, the, the Blue Jays have just matched their hit total from the last time they faced Blake Snell. They allowed one hit over six innings. Swinging and drive, left field. Tommy Pham is back at the wall, at the fence, gone! Lourdes Gurriel has hit in six games since he's come up from Buffalo. And Gurriel hits his fourth home run, and just like that, the Blue Jays have a 2 0 lead. I think we're going to see Lourdes Gurriel in that number two spot for a while. I think he is perfect for that spot. Brandon Drury waiting in the on deck area. Smoke leads at second. Pelez does the same at first with the infield back looking to turn two and the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a line drive caught by Brandon Lau as he dives to his right and he will flip to the shortstop Adamas and they will double up smoke. The line out double play that goes four to six gets the Rays out of this inning. Thornton's 1 0. That's off the fist in the air towards left center field. Carrying well. Jonathan Davis on the run. Dives and he makes the catch. Holy cow. Jonathan Davis springs out of the turf yelling off into the distance because he makes the highlight reel of all highlight reel catches. What a diving grab made by Jonathan Davis. It retires the side and it keeps Toronto in front. Two to nothing. We haven't seen catches like that since... Kevin Pillar. <laughs> Freddie Galvis raised his hand like he was a referee in the middle of a ring because he just crowned him the champion. That was incredible. First and third, two out for Abasayil Garcia. Ground ball headed toward the middle. That will get through. Meadows scores. Fan goes to third. It's two to one now. Hit that home run off David Price in the eighth inning. And here he strikes out. Good fastball upstairs. Coming off of Tommy John surgery last year. There's a swing and a miss by Robertson. Thornton strikes him out. And the inning is over. He's gone. Pitch is a ball, and the throw is a strike. And he is out at second base. Adama's taking the peg, putting the tag on Davis. The Krantz didn't even bother to get up. Snell's going as far as he can with Sogard. And now the 3 2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Did he go? There's a cut and a miss. He came back with the breaking ball. Got him there. With a man in scoring position and now with one out. Brandon Lau will be the batter. And a shot into right center field. Well tagged. That will one hop the wall. Meadows scores. Fan heads to the plate. It's a double for Lau. And the Rays take the lead. Blake Snell obviously struggled a little bit in the first inning. Gave up a hit to the first four batters in a row. And they settled in nicely. You can see the difference. The next four innings gone out there. Only giving up two hits in that one walk. I mean, his command's been good. And a swing and a miss. After a long pause to Galvis, here it is. Swing and a fly ball left field. Fam in a couple of steps. And he has the beat. He's there to make the catch. And a two out war proves to be harmless. It'll be interesting to see how much we can give Guerrero Jr. here to hit. I understand he's 0 for 7 on the series, but still so dangerous at the plate. You know, five home runs in the month of May. He's just heating up now. And he got it there. Strike three call. Guerrero caught looking. And strike three call got him. Got him looking right there. Three pitches from Caleri. It really does not get enough credit. Runner goes again. This time the pitch is inside. It's taken. The tag, and they got him. A good throw by Danny Jansen. He had to go up and in and pull that ball almost off of Kevin Kiermaier's shirt. It's the second time in as many innings that the Blue Jays have had a runner at second with nobody out down by a run. And he swings it's a line drive to right field, sinking quickly, and it falls in front of Garcia and bounces off his leg towards Kiermaier. Guriel getting the wave as Garcia picks it up. The throw home is cut, and the Blue Jays have tied the game. Ground ball, right side, out of the plate. And at first, the Rays get a big double play. Galvez hit it right into the ship. Fly ball into center. Back goes Kimmer. He gets it, and the Rays get out of that with this game tied. What a double play ball and a fly ball to center. 
Line drive to left field. Pam can't get it. It's over his glove off the wall. Guerrero's headed for second. Here's the throw. He slides in safely. That was a laser beam. Almost hits Guerrero then down and away. And a cut and a miss. He strikes him out coming back in with 98. And a looping fly ball short left center. And there is Pham to make the catch. Tommy Pham angling to his left and in got there in time. Adamas will be the hitter. Base is loaded one out. And a five-man infield. And they're pulled up. Swing and a drive. Center field when this lands. Rays win. Rays win. Rays win. And the Rays finish off a sweep of the Blue Jays.